Hey droners, guess what I'm not doing right now? I'm not failing at droning because I'm droner. But that's what we're gonna talk about today is drone fails because that's what people do all the time. Let's get into it. All right, coming in at number seven, we have a drone slamming into a building. Twice, yes, twice. Pretty much, you watch this, this actually happened on Super Bowl Sunday, which is part of the tag of the video for some reason. Um, but maybe they should have been sticking watching the game because as you can see, at 15 seconds in, they hit the building. And normally, it's a phantom that's flying, right? When you hit something with a phantom, 95% of the time, that's game over. It's gonna tumble to the ground, it's done. It's over, it's over, right? Nah, <laughs> this drone saves itself. You can hear the motors picking back up. And it's like, oh crap, this is amazing. He saved the drone, look how great this is. And then just, ah! right into the building again. And yeah, obviously hit the ground after that and it's probably not okay. Number six, trouble at the beach. Some idiot was at the beach and I'd be willing to bet he was drinking. I could just feel it. When you're watching this video, there's just a vibe to it. It's like a bro vibe. And he just like takes the drone off and he's flying over the beach over a bunch of people, obviously illegal. And it starts to like creep. It just like goes close to the sand and bam, just lands. And then there's like a bunch of, like, there's like three minutes of like kids prodding and kicking sand on it while it's on the ground, which is like, ah, like as a pilot, you're like, oh, why would you do that? And then like seven minutes in, this one kid just picks it up and he's like, look, it can still fly, it can still fly because the props never stop. No, it doesn't, it just falls again. And then about a few minutes later, after the kids have been drawing attention to themselves, some adults come up and give it to the lifeguards. Funniest part about this is that I found out it was a Phantom 2, which is obviously my favorite drone ever. And the lifeguards, that was a joke, I don't like the Phantom 2, it was horrible. But the lifeguards don't realize that the drone is still filming because they had a GoPro on it. And the GoPro just keeps filming this whole thing. And they start talking about stealing the drone, about stealing the GoPro. And at the very end of the video, the dude's like, bro, this is filming. Whoa. And then you hear, did it get our convert? And then they turn it off. <laughs> Coming to number five is a basketball bringing down a drone. Another genius flying over people, specifically kids, and you're like, oh look how cute the kids are, they have a basketball, that's so great, he's going to do a granny shot, oh he's going to throw it right at the, bam, hits the drone. <laughs> he brings it down and my favorite part of this video is you hear the guy who's flying the drone run up and say, who threw that basketball? And then somebody like the snitch is like, yeah, whatever his name is, <laughs> he's like, you just brought down a thousand dollar drone, and he's like, well, is it, is it broken? <laughs> it's like, yeah, it's broken, thousand dollars. And it's like, the kids are, you know, it's like, what? that doesn't mean anything to me. I have no sense of $1,000, but he knew he's in trouble. I'm going to start off number four in a really weird way. There is a Formula One driver named David Perel who does not fly the drone in this video. David Perel was sitting in his office on a fifth floor, fifth floor story building when a drone flies through the window and hits him in the head. That literally happened. Like, what kind of douchebag? Okay, I'm sorry. Either way, you can watch in the video because you actually have the drone video, which I'm sure he posted because he had the drone now, and it just like crashes through the window and just you just hear his surprise and shock and like it's just like what what just happened? Oh my god! You know, it's just I I don't know what I would have done. Like it just feels like you know lightning striking. To, I don't know. This is like the most unlikely thing to ever happen. I would never even think a drone could get through a window, not let alone hit someone inside of it after going through a window. So. Yeah, check it out. I feel really bad for the guy, but he made a really cool video out of it. Check it out. So coming in at number three is a, a drone that actually I have is an Injustress. First person view drone. It's a little tiny drone that's meant to train you on first person view flying. It's really cool. I love it. And this guy's doing it. He's flying around his house. And, you know, you can see it like you got the first person view. He's going around. He goes through the, the doorway, comes back, then goes back through. And then suddenly you see whew, pause of death. <laughs> the cat, this cat just jumps up and is like, Hurrah! <laughs> and just destroys it. I mean, because that's what cats do. Anything smaller than a cat is going to be destroyed. So, lesson to drone ops. If your drone is smaller than a cat, keep it away from the cat. Coming in number two. This one's an oldie but goodie, but it's a wedding drone fail. So there is an archway that he's going to go through. <laughs> he goes through the archway, and there's a couple standing on the other side of the archway, and I assume the shot is supposed to be through the archway and then majestically go past the couple into the distance. That did not happen. The first time he gave it a pass and oh, you know, I don't like it and it was shaky. So this man brings it back around. <laughs> he puts it back through, comes up, he's like, okay, I'm gonna make it. I got this. Tilts the drone forward, let's go. Comes in, all right, all right, all right. And you can even hear the motors trying to power up and get like up to go over. Doesn't go over. Yo, and the worst part is, is that they always do the wedding photography before the reception and before the 
Oh, God. So they had to go to the reception and like cut up face. I hope they at least got the group photography before they got this. Last but definitely not least is a drone fail. And this one's just super entertaining because of timing. And this one's at a skate park. A bro has a drone. And he's actually doing a pretty good job of keeping up with this guy who's skating around a bowl, you know, keeping him in frame. Um, this is obviously not a high quality drone. So props to him for doing that. Um, and the guy, the, the skater, he comes up the lip of the, uh, of the bowl and he does like a front flip. He's like, whoo, front flip, front flip. And the drone just <laughs> right into him in the middle of that front flip. And you just hear, doo -doo -doo -doo. so the drone obviously crashes. And then there's like a silent moment, like everybody's like, is everybody okay? And then they start laughing. So obviously everybody's okay, but it definitely failed because I'm sure that drone that sounded really cheap and looked really cheap and flew really cheap got destroyed. But you know, I guess you're the best of the worst. Droners, thank you for checking out our third installation of the Droner Fails video. We do have all the links of the videos below, because we do, and they're worth checking out. As always, make sure you click here for our intro video. If you haven't seen it, it is fire. Also, if you want to see more Droner Fail videos or things like that, you can click here, because we do a lot here at Droner. Otherwise, make sure that you go ahead and hit that subscribe button. That allows us to keep doing what we're doing, or hit up our Patreon page, because it's awesome. As always, you need to be the homie and make sure you stay fly.